you too. MLD back with episode two of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Uh, real quick, uh, as you can see, I'm kind of doing that young barrel roll. Um, tell me which is faster, because I'm not really sure. I always used a barrel roll in these games, and I thought, like, subconsciously that I was going faster. But I don't really think I am than just running, but I don't know. Barrel rolling seems like I'm actually getting something done. But that's just me. I don't know. Whatever. So this episode we're going to be taking out the first dungeon and Navi's going to be a stupid bitch. And yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, we're going to be taking out this whole dungeon because this dungeon is really, like, easy. This dungeon is basically to help you figure out what the fuck you're doing to introduce your items and all that good sh crafty shenanigans. And uh, we're going to sh uh, go in here and there's going to be, I think... A map, yeah, a map. There's a map or a compass, I wasn't really fucking sure. I don't know. I don't know this game. So we're gonna Kobe over here, and uh, oh, 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 we can press the, the, the blue button, and it does things and such, and yeah, yeah, no way. Uh, 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 yeah, okay. Um, that was completely unnecessary, but um, we're gonna go in here, locks is behind us, and we have to deal with this fucker. Um, Cause I'm stupid. And if you go up there like I did, uh, it doesn't come out, you gotta move back, and then you can run up and... Like, as soon as you hit it back, you can start, uh, push the, the, the little stick forward, and go straight at him. And he will, uh, you'll touch him, and then you'll be like, yeah. But if you don't touch him, he runs around the room, you can just stand where he, uh, goes back in. Like, that little part where he leaves the heart, you can just stand there, and then he'll be like, hey, yo, nigga, you got me. Um, but what he just says, you can barrel roll off things, and then you just... You do crafty stuff, and then when you jump really high and all that stuff. But this right here gives you uh, the sling doogie, and uh, if, if you didn't see it, a little animation shows you to the uh, the right of where we're gonna be when the camera hands back over. Whenever this thing stops telling you stuff, boo bop, baby bop. Um, yeah. Uh, so. Okay, I guess it's just not gonna do that at all. We're gonna equip this thing real quick, but there's a little area over there, like where, to the right of where we were just aiming, like, see, it's right there. It just has a heart in it, it's no big deal. It's nothing cool. I thought it was something cool, cause first time I played this game, uh, I kinda sucked at it. Then the second time I went through it with a guide, and then the guy never said him, didn't say anything about that, and then I was like, oh, broken, and then it just, it was a fucking heart. So we're gonna shoot this motherfucker. You can Z target him, which is nice, and then whip it out and just smack him in the face with it. So that always helps. And you can also just go into the analog, but like most of the game, most of the time, the game doesn't like to be nice to me and let me target that high up. But um, I usually have to fucking snipe him down. But I guess this time it was pretty nice to me. Whatever. So we're gonna go climb up here. Uh, those things are assholes, by the way. And uh, if you don't kill them, they will fucking be pricks to you, or something like that. I don't know. They do something. I've always, I don't I don't think I've ever like went up there without like getting hit by them. But uh, don't worry about those right now. I'm gonna shoot over here to get the compass because I don't fucking know why. Uh, this is pretty easy. That other platform is a lie. It's for it's for like a scatula or something. So don't 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 use it. The first time I tried jumping all three, and then I fucked up, and then I kept doing it, and I'm fucking. I thought you couldn't make it. That's why they put three. But whatever. So we get the compass. Um, compass is pretty cool. It tells you where you are in the room where you came in, which is nice because um, I suck at this game. You know. Yeah. Um, it tells you where you came in, which also helps in just confusing rooms and stuff. But we have to go light a Dooku stick like this motherfucker. And uh, you can press B while you have a lit Dooku stick, and it'll slash and you'll save your Dooku stick, which is really nice. Because Dooku sticks go for damage. And then we're going to kill one of these assholes, because they're assholes. And... Yeah. If you get far back enough, you can jump attack them, but uh, if, if, if you're not far enough back, you'll get hurt, and it just, it, it's a giant waste of time. So I usually like to just double slash them, because I'm fucking lazy. There's a heart over there, but fuck it. So you land in this big thing, and then you go down the water, and it's kind of obvious. Uh, we're going to kill this thing first, because uh, we got to run over there. 
And uh, it was nice and gave us a Dooku stick. We're gonna slash some bushes, because I don't fucking know why. And there's some Skatulas around here. Um, there's one over there where you can like jump into, but it's a huge fucking pain in the ass. And I'm just literally not gonna do it. And the other one, if you climb up that thing, you could shoot it and then climb up and get it. And I'm not gonna do that either, because I don't fucking wanna do Skatulas on you. All you get is like fucking a bigger wallet or some shit. Yeah, fuck that shit. We don't need money. We got bank son. But yeah. Uh, if you can see in the water, there's a small little area where you can run on, and then the rest you dip into, and then you, I think you lose your stick. I'm not sure. When you fight one of these guys, and it's like, hey, yo, I'm gonna tell you something. And then, like, this is like the dumbest thing ever, but whatever. Um... It just takes ignorantly long for some reason. I don't. I think that they should have sped up the uh, the text scrolls. But as you can see, we still can't get out. So we have to use the little thingy and shoot that thing in the eye. Whenever you see those eyes, just fucking shoot them. They're fucking dicks and they deserve it. Something like that. So we walk into here and I, oh, 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 obviously we can't read the fucking blue button by now because you explained it to us like 15 fucking times because I, I just, I just, I'm just the most retarded person in America. But uh, what we do is we just go down here and dive. Hit that young button. It uh, lowers the water for a pretty long amount of time so we can jump back up to here, go around, reposition our camera so we can fucking see what the fuck's going on jump on this little doohickey and it's like oh hey that's a big spiky log thingy and then you can jump up here there's another one of these assholes I don't know why the fuck they put these things and yeah, this is what I get for not having my sword equipped oh, God. so we beat this asshole and uh, obviously we can't read the blue button I mean like, I just, I just, how are we reading these huge blocks of text, but we just can't, like, that bothers me, like, who, who do you think playing this game? Really? Really? You think by this point you can't just go, hey, grab, holy fucking shit, what a miracle, could not have figured that out if it wasn't for Navi, thank Jesus, but, uh, if you run at these and then press A, it'll turn into climb, and then you can climb. And it's, it's crafty, and then you can slam your head into a door. And that's that's pretty neato, too. And at this point, it's pretty obvious, you, obvious what you need to do. So I'm just going to do it. Um, there's some guys on the side that will give you those them, them sticks. And I probably should have gotten more, because sticks are pretty nice and crafty and stuff. But yeah... Um, we're gonna run through here, and we are in this, and then this asshole drops out of nowhere, and I completely fucked that up, and I'm, oh, you're gonna take the beating. Damn it, what the, yo, I fucking suck, there we go. Alright, see, so but you gotta be at, like, a good distance back. So, so what's, so what's going on here, there's some things up on top, and they're a little, I don't really know how to trigger them, but apparently you can trigger them, and then just want to run around and then they pop down and like hey yo. so we're gonna fucking all right so i was aiming for that one but that's fine i guess and we're gonna shoot this thing in the eye and this is like oh you could shoot these things in the eye and they look just like the boss up oh, spoiler shoot them in the fucking mouth so we take this thing and run down there there's a skatool over there but you need bombs to get it so i think you need bomb you need some other item that we don't have that we can't get so we're obviously not going to get it, A, because uh, I don't have that item, and B, because it's a fucking Skatula. Fuck it. Does it deserve our love? And, uh, yeah. So, uh, the whole thing with the Skatulas is that there's a fucking... They give you tokens, and then if you get all 100 tokens, all the people, they become non-fucking spiders. There's, like, this house in Karakuri Town. And they give you shit, and then I think a big old fucking prize is, like, $200. And you're like, what the fuck is this shit? They got, see, I, you, see, I already got banged. So you push that thing down. Push that thing down even if you don't know what the fuck you're doing. Because that thing is just, you do not want to do this whole thing over again. Because it's just a pain in the fucking ass. You do barrel roll with the flaming piece of stick. And, uh, shoot down here. And then, like that guy said, you have to do number two. Or you could get pelted in the fucking ass like I did. 
Um, but you bounce that nigga back, and then he's like, oh, okay, we're just gonna shoot you in the mouth. That's what we do, because we're dicks. Shoot the second one, the third one, and then you hit the first one. Pretty simple. And I completely forgot that he starts running around. They're just like, why is he blue? I'm fucking dumb. What? Uh, yeah, so he, uh, he's, he's, he's babbling. He's like, yeah, you just got a sword in the fucking dome. And if that wasn't just completely obvious or not, I'm not really sure. We lose Ron a little heart because we got fucking pelted in the dome a couple times. And this is the boss battle. And this is, this is how you shit on this boss. The first time I came in here, I was just like, all right, what the fuck do I do? And I ran around for like 10 minutes. You have to actually look up at the boss like this. Watch. Door closed behind you. And you have to take out like a fucking the doogie. And you have to look up at the boss. And the boss has to see, see the eye. It won't trigger the bell unless you do that. And I didn't know you had to do that. I thought this bitch just dropped out of nowhere. Uh, it's probably because it's fucking dumb. But anyways. So this is this bitch. You shoot her in the eye with the fucking... That. And then it's pretty easy. You just beat the shit out of her with... Dooku sticks are pretty nice. I just completely wasted that Dooku stick. And then she runs up here to do her attack or whatever the fuck this is. I don't, I'm not really sure what attack this is, but she starts doing something. You just shoot into the fucking eye and she drops back down and you beat the shit out of her. Like, you do, do you see how easy that was? Like, this is like, if she doesn't even have an attack, she just runs around while you beat the shit out of her. That's literally, that, that is the first thing. So that is the first boss of the game. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, thank you guys for subscribing. Yeah, go do that. Um, check out my Twitter. Check out all this stuff. Check out all the fun fun things that I have on my channel, I guess. Um, there'll be more of these to come. These will be on Mondays and Thursdays, if you don't already know. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, uh, yeah, okay.